go. But uh, we are going for all the hard mode medals. We've made a decent start, I feel like. Uh, yes, we did the freaking secret squad the other day. I'm probably have to leave the rest of those medals to last, because my god, my god, I do not like that squad. My god. Let's see, so we got the groups we don't have any hard mode medals are no Blitzkrieg, Steel Judoka, and Random Squad. You know what? Let's start with one of the harder ones. I feel like Steel Judoka is one of the uh, harder squads because the damage on them is so low. One damage, one damage, and there's a dude. <clears throat> so, um, should I use Mafon? If I use Mafon, I might be able to. I just love the extra energy on him. The fun extra energy is so good. All right, well, let's give this a shot. Let's see what we can start out the day with here. Let's see what we can start out the day with here. Um, where do I want to put that power? So I can make it so that if I put uh, my fun, my fan, mathin, and here we could make it so enemies do plus two damage to each other. Can make buildings immune with this one. Uh, actually, I probably wouldn't. How much power do you have? Just one. I can make allies immune with this one. I think I want to actually try seeing if we can really try to get enemies to damage each other. See if that is a possibility. All right, where do we want to go first? I've got a couple of places with guys with only one health. That will help with our low damage dudes to start off. Start off with, I'm thinking. All right, destroy the acid vats. Defend both power plants. Block Vex spawning three times. Both power plants. Let's do this one first. Let's take two damage. Um, I wonder if you could throw the acid vats on top of Vec with the throwing guy. I think you... Can you throw... Let me see here. I don't think you can throw guys onto something else, so probably not. But let's do this one. Let's start off with this one. Yeah, so we got Explode a Dude. This guy. Okay, alright. So I can throw this guy and he'll die. Or shoot that guy and he'll die. Or I can pull, pull a thing into a thing. Pull a thing into a thing. Looks like go. No, you could go there, but you could still shoot that guy. All right, all right. Let's get started, man. We're 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 in a breach. All right. So what I could do is I can't throw that guy. Damn. Um. Uh, I could. Pull this guy, and he'll block a thing and shoot that way. Um, if I throw that guy, he'll die and explode. But this guy's armored, so I don't think he'll take any damage from that. I wonder if I could make it so he explodes to do damage onto here. I don't think I could do that. Our only bonus objective is destroying these vats, so. Hmm, if I do that. Actually, make so he dies when he goes on there. But then he'll shoot this guy for one. Shoot that guy for one. Am I okay with that? I think so. Hey, good morning, Pink Floyd Wall. <laughs> Pink Floyd Wall, how are you doing? All right, all right, let's do this. Let's do this. So we're going to first shoot this guy. That means when I pull you, you'll die when you block that. Actually, now, nah, if that guy shot before he went, that would be even more perfect. But no such luck. Oh, huh. So armor does not block exploding damage, apparently. Only weapon damage. So we will take one there. But we block that thing, so that's, I'm okay with that. Fine, pretty happy you caught my stream. Well, awesome. I just started, so you'll be able to catch the whole six hours or however long we stream. Maybe longer today. So, I'm glad you're happy. 
Alright, let's see here. I need to kill this guy to stop them from exploding. How can I actually do that? Now what I could do is blow him that way and then pull him this way. Actually, hold on a second here. If I were to pull him this way, pull him this way, pull this guy this way, shoot there, that'll do one damage, knock him there to block that, and I can have him throw that guy there and he'll shoot nothing. Cool, I like it. Uh, although I did want to do that so I can do even more damage to that guy. All right, the Hydra bot. Thanks for the reminders, my friend. Okay, so we do this. We shoot here. Does one damage. We'll die from that. And you'll die from... Now, the question will be... Oh, crap. I might lose this guy if he explodes first. Is there a way to tell... I don't know if there's a way to tell which of these things comes out first. Because if this guy dies first and explodes, this guy's dead. Emote mode disabled? Ah, ah. I, I don't know if there's a way for me to turn <laughs> stay hydrated by emotes on. So. I guess we'll find out. I hope I don't die. I hope I don't die. Sweet. He died first. Beautiful. Got lucky there. All right, I guess yeah, you got it. You got it, Renus. Nice. Ooh, can I actually do this? Ooh, I can use the vat to block a spawn. Okay, that's pretty epic. Let's see here. Let me see here. Yeah, we definitely want to do that. That'll kill one of those. Um, let me see here. Probably need to work on destroying this other vat, so... Oh, gosh. I want to push that guy there. Well, if I do this, my issue is going to be killing this last vat the following turn. Which is going to be a challenge when I got... I'll have to deal with four vec. Okay, what if I do this? If I move this guy here... I can throw him there. We'll block his shot. Yeah, let's do this. And he'll block another vec. So we block three vec from spawning. All right. Cool. All right, we'll do that. Oh, wow, and it's an alpha. Oh, cool. All right. Beep, boop. Alright, well now this is kind of a challenge because now we have this to destroy and wow, three Vec doing things that I don't want them to do. Do I have any AoE? I have that which can push him out there. So I'll free him. What if I shot here? Then through that guy there. And I take one core damage as I move that guy. That might actually be what I want to do. Can this guy move here to throw that guy? Because that, that will let me kill this and stop most of the damage. I think that's uh, I think that actually works. Let's try this. We can reset turn and this doesn't work. Pretty sure this will work. Cool. Alright. So that'll do that objective because you do three damage. 
You do five freaking damage, man. All right. Um. No, that doesn't work. Oh gosh. Well, I don't want to pull that guy because he'll actually kill that guy. Well, even though you do what three damage, that's only one damage you can't do to that. So we'll just pull you and take only the one damage there. All right. All right. One grid damage. But we get our bonus objectives. I'll say that was worth. We could even resist. And now 15% resist. 15% equals zero. All right, not a bad start. Going for that perfect island. I'm glad, I'm happy that perfect islands means we can still kill civilians. <laughs> what a perfect island. We killed all the civilians and took all their stuff. Kill four enemies with acid, protect the emergency batteries, and we get an acid tank. Oh gosh, this one will be tough because we do so little damage. Even with the acid, we only do two damage. We need to get Vec to hurt each other to really to really do it. But you know what? Do I think this one will be easier, blocking Vec three times and defend both power plants? Actually, this one might be easier. Let's do this one. Because if somebody goes there, we can throw them. Well, okay, we have two guys with only one health. That's pretty, actually, amazing. Uh, I'm going to guess this guy's going to probably go there to shoot that. So if he does that, I can use my guy to pull him into the water. If one of these guys goes over on this side, we'll want to do that. And he can move up to right there. All right, all right, let's give this a try. We gotta remember to get the Vec block spawning thing in the bobber. Okay, cool. So I can't kill him with that guy. Okay. You rat, my dude. Okay. I have no way to block Vec spawning this time, except you know, if I could move that guy. Actually, if I shoot right here, I free him, save that, kill that guy, free him so I can pull that guy. Yeah, let's go ahead and do that. And I can kill this guy. Don't stop any Vec from spawning this turn, but hopefully we can do that, get that going next turn. All right, all right, good. Fewer enemies this time, only have three instead of four. Although one's an exploder, dude. Okay, nice. And they really don't want this guy to be able to move anywhere. I really don't like that. Um, let's see here. All right, I really need to block some Vex spawning, and I can't, just can't this. Um, let's see here. Hey, what's up, Derrida? How are you doing, my friend? If I do that... Ooh, do that. There we go. That's lovely. That would actually allow this guy to be able to go block something down here. Oh, that's a great thing. That'll kill two dudes. Two dudes with one stone. Get wrecked, dudes. You can repair yourself. I could throw that in the water, but let's get two Vex blocks, bunning, majigger things going on here. Good morning, Desert Eagle. How are you doing, my friend? How are all you fine folks doing this morning? Although it's probably an evening for a lot of you folks in in Europe and all those wonderful, cool places that you all live in. Uh, let's see here. So I can kill you that way. I can block that while throwing you. And then I continue to block, and that'll get our Vec block spawning thing done. Yeah, let's do that. 
Hope you all are having a fine, fine Monday. Probably for some of you, the work day is over, so that's a good thing. <clears throat> so I, um, have been dealing with, for the last few years, like, you know you're getting old when you deal with, like, constant, like, annoying health things. Like, I've been dealing with, um, what's it called? Uh, acid reflux, you know, like, burping all the time and all that kind of stuff. And, um... I just got, went and bought a pill today that will hopefully help with that. I don't know if it will or not, but we'll, we'll see. You know you're old. You know you're old when you're doing that. Okay, so, actually, ooh, ooh. Okay, so we can do... I'm not sure what I want to do with this guy, though. Shoot right there. Does one damage to him. But what I think I want to do is throw this guy in front of that. He'll block that. And actually, I think it'll take... I think he might kill that guy. And then I pull this guy. to get a kill there. Nice. Actually able to use... This, are they going to shoot each other? Nope, that guy's going to kill that guy. But that's fine. That is fine. We still get a kill. Um, I could shoot you for no reason. Or shoot you for one back, but it won't kill you. So, uh... Just... That's fine. Alright, nice. <clears throat> but... Anyway, I don't know why I told you guys that. <laughs> I took a little pill to help with acid reflux. Hopefully it'll help my voice. That's the main thing I'm actually interested in, is helping my voice not tire out so easily. Because apparently acid reflux... Can uh, cause like, um, can cause like congestion and vocal fatigue and stuff like that. So I'm hoping this will help. Seven enemies protect the coal plant. Well, I feel like if I'm gonna kill four enemies with acid, this will be easier than killing seven enemies. So let's go. Let's go for this one. Let's do this thing. All right, two guys with one health. I like that. Uh, except that. Got an exploder dude here. So at least one of these guys are going to attack this guy for sure. So what I want to do is have this guy be able to shoot that. Because if they go around him, I actually want them to surround him. So where do I think you'll go? You'll probably go. You'll probably stay here and shoot that. So I want to be able to move you there and throw you into the water would be great. So I want them to actually surround this guy. Uh, all right, let's see what happens. Let us see what happens. Vec infestation detected. You are an infestation. Wow, okay, well you didn't go after the acid guy, all right. Well, let's see how we want to do this. So I can throw you behind me, and that will kill you, but then you take two damage. What I could do is shoot you. That would free you. Then I could throw you in front of him. And you would kill that guy. Problem is if I do that, you'll explode that. Am I okay with that? Am I okay with taking one core damage? Yeah, I think I'm okay with that. I think I'm okay with that. So we're gonna do this. That will kill that. Oh, crap. Damn it. Well, maybe there's another way to do that. If I shoot right there, it'll slam him into that. Yeah, and we won't take core damage there. All right. Sorry, people who live in this building. You're about to get wrecked. Do that. Yeah. Sorry, folks. 
Uh, oh, they resisted only to die from the explosion. Oh, man, what a way to go. Ah, oh, crap. I was going to use... Oh, well. Okay, well, that actually works, too. <laughs> like, I was going to use to block that shot. There's no reason to block that shot. All right, we're fine. Okay, all right. So that's two acid deaths. Two acid kills already. At least we got that, that going. <clears throat> That guy refuses to uh, move over. Well, let me see. If I were to go here, pull you, you'll actually shoot and kill this guy. You are firing at that. I could throw you, kill you. I could shoot that guy that way and he'll die. Okay, all right. All right, I like it, I like it. Sorry I have to slam him against your own self, sir. Okay, shoot acid there, I'll make him die from this. You will block that and kill that guy. Beautiful. All right, you just got to kill one more guy with acid and we're good. Get wrecked. Wow, that was five damage because of the bonus that we have. Seriously, this guy will not stay on this row so I can throw him into the water. Rude, let me throw you into the water. All right, well, this isn't actually a horrible fight. Acid you, I will do... Decent damage, you'll block again. Let me see here. Let me see here. Is there a way I can use them to kill each other here? I'd have to get this guy here and this guy there. Uh, let's see. If this guy could move further, I could actually do it. But I need him to move that way. And this guy's move is terrible. So we won't probably do anything that fancy. We'll just uh, put acid on this guy. Go there, throw him that way. That'll do two damage, he'll block. He'll be one off of lethal. I can actually knock this guy into the drink. Or do one damage, use him block, but now nah, we'll just throw him into the water. There we go. Vec need to learn how to swim. Let's make snappy one-liners. Okay. All right, we have one more turn to... Uh... Eh, we'll pull you this way just so you're a little closer. Sure, why not? Snappy one-liners, that's the, that's the way we talk to Vec. Who do we want to get the experience on? <clears throat> uh, I don't have a way to get experience on you, so probably... We probably want to get the ally immune on this guy the most, so... We'll get the kill on you with you. So we'll give you the most experience. And that's GG on that. Beautiful. And then you have... Hey, what's up, Lego Power? How are you doing, my friend? Actually, I do have a way to get experience, but it would make you take damage. So we won't do that. Alright. Because if I do this, it'll knock him into that guy, but then that guy explodes, so... We won't do that. Alright, GG. Alright. How are you doing, Lego Power? How was your Monday, my friend? Monday, Monday, can't trust that day. I should just play that song from my playlist every Monday I stream. Although that would probably be too Mimi. Too Mimi? Little, little Mimi? 
Kill seven enemies. They really want me to kill seven enemies. Holy crap. Uh, let's see. Seven enemies. Don't have that much water there. I feel like I'd need water. Uh, or acid. I don't know that we could actually get a seven enemy kill on any of these places. We would need a lot of the one health guys, which maybe we'll get. Well, we got lots of conveyor belts protecting stuff here. So... Let's go for it. Let's see if we can do it. So far, we have a perfect island, but... Alright, we got one health guy there. Uh, okay. We'll do this. It's a bank holiday. Oh, really? Well, it was Easter yesterday, so... That makes sense. Do you work for a bank? So do you actually have the day off? That'd be pretty awesome. Also, you're free now of your crap job. You're unemployed now. <laughs> Is that good or bad? I'm not sure that's good or bad. If I do this, it does one damage to you. And what I'd love to do is have you get knocked back and you go over that way. Do I have a way to do that? Let you kill your own friend. Do I have a way to do that? If I did that, that would shoot. Eh, well, that would kill that guy. buildings immune on this. All employees and most non-vital services get bank holidays off here or they have to pay you double pay. Oh, nice. That's pretty awesome. Ooh, what I could do is if I throw this guy, he'll move over and shoot this guy before he does any damage. There we go. There we go. Now the question becomes how can I block something without doing damage to my own guys? Of course, I could just knock that guy out of the water, too. But I feel like I want to make use of him killing that guy, so... How can I kill this guy without doing damage to my own buildings? I have a way to do it. Let me see here. If I pulled that guy into that guy, I would do one damage each. Or just outright kill that guy if we wanted to do that. Problem is if I kill anybody before I kill this thing, they explode. So I gotta remember that. So if I throw this guy anywhere before this guy's dead, he explodes. I don't want that to happen. So I think I could just not kill this guy this turn. So let's do what we were going to do. We're going to throw this guy that way. That deals with that. Main issue is that I can't block a spawn, which is what I'd really like to do. But I can do one damage to that guy. I did not mean to do that. That was a mistake. All right. Well, I can't do one damage to that guy now. Great. All right, we'll put this guy in position to pull somebody in the water or something here. My finger slipped. All right. All right. Well, hopefully one damage off on this guy won't screw me too hard. Oh, crap. He exploded anyway. Damn it. Uh. All right. Well, whoops. Yeah, at least he's got acid on him. <laughs> Crap. Okay. That guy's gonna move. If I do that, he'll block that and do no damage to anything. I 
want to do that with that guy, though. Let's see. I could pull this guy here. Seems good. I like that. Uh, that would kill that guy. And then throwing him onto there would kill that guy. So that's okay. I think I'm okay with that. Just a couple hundred casualties. <laughs> eh, nobody liked those guys anyway. That guy's going to explode, though. I'm going to keep a... He'll explode. Which will actually kill that guy anyway. I'm okay with that. That guy will explode, which will kill that guy. Eh, actually, I think that's fine. You're wondering, but you don't know the ins and outs of this game? Alright, cool. That actually is great. So now I can use you to block that. And then you block. I gotta kill seven enemies, though. Um. One, two, three. I need to kill three more. So if I let these two spawn, then this guy plus those two will be all the kills I need. Alright, alright. We'll do we'll stick with that. Alright. Don't lose out on my chance. I'll get the perfect island. Perfect island. Perfect. Nice. So I can pull this guy in there. Uh, can I kill this guy? I was not expecting quite this many guys to spawn. Well, I mean, this many more guys to spawn. So I can go there. Do one damage to you. Can't throw this guy in any direction. Uh, let's see here. So I could pull this guy that way. I still have to kill three more dudes. Uh, they live in an industrial wasteland. Their quality of life couldn't have been that good. Well, you know, <laughs> living right next door to acid. You have a point. You have a point. Actually, hold on a second here. What if I could move this guy here? No, he'll hit there because of that thing. That's just Australia? <laughs> <laughs> this is Australia. Australia is a wasteland? Does Australia know this? Okay, what if I move him over that way? And then throw him that way. Yeah, that'll work. If I can do that, can I do that? Shoot you that way. Oh, that'll actually kill you. Oh, well, that works too. And you're shooting nothing. Okay, cool. We got our plan here. The man with the plan. Beautiful. And we gotta kill one more guy. Alright, whoever comes out of here will have acid, so we should be good. Could you not move him with missile, then throw him? Yep, that's exactly what I ended up doing. Yep. You could do. You could be onto something. Vecar invaders, just Australian wildlife set free. <laughs> well, you know, Australia is known for their giant insects, right? I don't know if that's right or not, actually. Okay. So if I do this, that would let that guy move there. I could shoot that guy. That would kill you and kill you. Wow, we're getting plenty of kills. Yeah, let's do that. Go there. Kill both of you dudes. Beautiful. Hey, we even got a level up. Very nice. Very, very nice. And I can't really do anything to you, so we'll just dodge your attack and make you look foolish. Get you off of the conveyor belt, because that would put you in acid. We care about our friends here. 
Crikey! That's the largest beetle I've ever seen! We're basically... Um, what's his face? What was the, uh... Steve, Steve Irwin? We're basically Steve Irwin. Basically. Alright, what do we got? Uh, gain plus three move on the first turn of every mission. Not bad. And you've got plus one move. Okay, alright. Who got the plus one move? That was you? Alright. So let's go ahead and replace this guy here. Okay. Um, I think, uh, well, I'd like to get buildings immune, but I need two things on this. Two uh, reactor cores. Alright, alright. Well, we'll still give it to you. I will give you move. Well, you have you have four move just automatically. Wow. Okay. All right. So we'll go ahead and give you, or do I want to give you health? Now nah, we'll give you move, and then we'll get buildings immune with hopefully another um, another reactor core here. Oh, good morning, Irma Irma Gear Kenny Irma Gear. How are you doing, sir? Irma Gear Kenny. Here we go. Uh, let's hope we can kill some dudes here. I'm gonna guess. It's just a wild guess. You're gonna go here, here, or here. And if I move you by one space, if I throw you, I'll be good. So we'll put you there. We'll put you up here. I feel like we'll get us our best positioning. And you there. All right. Hopefully we can use the boss to kill this guy. That's the hope. Okay, we can do that if we can move this guy is the thing. Two damage, so... So if I were to move this guy that way, pull this guy that way, and he would kill that guy. Killing the boss is going to be the issue because we have so little damage. So it would actually be crazy if I could use one of these guys to do damage to him. Um, that feel when Ecursus has more viewers than you. Oh, <laughs> oh God. Uh, well, that's kind of rude, but okay. Thanks, Kenny. Thanks for letting me know. Appreciate that. Uh, let me see here. If I throw you this way, take damage. Okay. What's up, Warfrogger? Um, and oh, you're just responding to this. Okay. Um, let me see here. I could do this, and then I'll just free both those guys. And then I could throw this guy that way. Is that what I want to do? If I were this guy that way, he would do one whole damage to that guy. It's not hardly any damage. What time is it there? Because it's not even 9 a.m. here yet. Where I am, it is 11.30 a.m. I live in Dallas, Texas, so that's... My time frame looks like. Oh God, I do two damage to myself if I do that. If I go here, would that break? I don't think that would break him out of there. But I could throw him. Well. Killing this guy is going to be a big issue. Um, I don't think that breaks them since he stays in place. If I throw you, you go there. You would be free, but then he'd hit that thing. I wouldn't be able to pull him out of it. Wow, you have a lot of move. Okay.
cat. I really need I really need to make this. I really wish I could have gotten buildings immune on this guy available. All right, I think I just need to uh, free these guys turn one here. And then throw that guy. Yeah, I think that's going to be our best bet. Actually, I can throw this guy there. Okay. And then I can pull this guy to hit that guy. Yes, I like that. So he'll die. Alright, cool. Ah, oh, crap. This guy lost a shield from being hit there, so that will kill him. Reset turn. Damn it. Hey, what's up, Shogi? How are you doing, sir? How are you doing, my friend? Nah, we just can't block, but that's fine. Otherwise, I liked everything else there. What's armor do? Just block one damage per attack? Yes. Um, weapon damage, this user reduced by one. So, things like push blocking and fire all do the same amount of damage, but... Uh, Anytime you get hit by a guy, it's only one, it's less damage. Oh, that guy does three damage. Okay, sweet. I forgot about our bonus thing, nice. Yeah, yeah, just like Dead and Eagle said. Well, crap. A lot of stuff going on here, all right. Um, if I were to do this, that would not even kill that guy. Okay. So I could pull that guy. I'd love to use the Vec to kill their boss, but he's so far away from everyone else, and everybody's shooting the wrong direction. I don't think I can do that. I think I have to do this. Free this guy, and then... Could kill that guy. I think we're going to be able to stop this damage here. But I need to do this to take less damage here. Do that. Do that. And then you. What are you going to do? I would use you to block that, but we lose that corporate tower. So I think I have to shoot like this. To kill that guy. Actually, it would do a little bit more damage if we do it like this. So at least we do one damage to that guy. All right. All right. Can't stop that damage or block any vec. Sad days. Sad times. So, Shogi, what have you been up to, sir? Just working? Hey, we resisted. We resisted. Okay, maybe I can use this guy to shoot that guy somehow. I guess probably not, actually, with the way things are... The direction guys are going. Yikes. Okay, okay. How much damage you can do? Three. Let's give him two to him, then he'll block for one. Kill him, this guy, man. How am I going to kill this guy? If I were to pull this guy and throw him, I could get him there. Actually, if I were to pull this guy... Throw this guy and move that guy over one more. Or if I shot him once, moved him over, and then moved that guy over one. Oh, wait, no, I'd have to do it this way. Oh, damn it, but that makes this, this guy hit that thing. Wow, 
Wow, that does... Pretty good chunk of damage there. there. Because I'm almost able to get this guy to shoot this guy. I could get this guy to shoot this guy. The issue becomes... I lose this thing here if I do that. Is there a way for me to block this while moving this guy and this guy in a way? Hey, what's up, Deluxe Minimal? Problem is, I gotta use two people to move guys around. LARP Freak! <laughs> what a name! Thank you so much for the follow. Appreciate it. Welcome to the stream, my friend. Welcome to the stream. If I were to throw you there, pull you... Nah, I couldn't get that to work. So, looks like I need to wait one more turn to try to kill this guy. So I think I may do this, because that's my... I freeze this guy up here. I do that. Beep -boo. Shot. What if I shot this guy that way? He would block that spawn. These guys are just doing all this damage to these buildings, though. So much building damage going on right now. I could do what I was going to originally do. Kill that guy, block that shot. Shoot. Shoot right there. That'll make him do no damage. And then pull this guy. I don't know if I'm going to be able to kill the boss, but I think that's what I'm going to have to do. Just trying to avoid taking too much grid damage. Too much grid damage is... Too much good damage. I can block this spawn. Do I want to block two spawns? Do I think I can kill this boss for damage? I would have to... I would have to be able to use this guy to shoot this guy next turn. But if I block more spawns, hopefully that will mean we'll have to avoid less grid damage. So maybe we'll actually be able to do it. Well, I want this guy to move down here and attack. He's probably going to go there again. Alright, let's see if we can line it up here. Come on, you go, like, right there or something. Good. Yes! Okay. All right, how much damage do you do? You do two. So you'll only take one from this guy, correct? Yes. If I go here and throw... Oh, you're not shooting the right direction. Okay, hold on a sec. If I pull you... Throw you... I think he would actually die first, so I need you to go that way. So if I shoot you that way, it'll do one damage. Throw you that way, should kill him. Because three... Oh yeah, that'll definitely kill him. Beautiful. We're actually doing what Judoka was made to do, and that is... Make them kill each other. Beautiful. And then you do just move there and heal yourself. It's lovely when we can actually make these guys do what they're supposed to do. Bam! Nice! And stay dead! <laughs> Beautiful, man. Alright. Plus two mech HP. I'd rather you get core, but alright. All right, perfect. Island is perfect. Power grid is reduced to one. All buildings gain a shield. Now that's interesting. Um, I don't really want to have something that relies on me getting that low on health, so let's get this guy. Oh, you sent me two new class designs in my DMs. Okay, sweet. I will read those later, sir. Awesome. So that's what you've been working on. Beautiful. We know we're selling this guy. Do I want to keep this guy? The adjacent tiles and repairing is kind of worthless. I really don't even like that skill, so I think I'm just going to sell you, sir. 
All right, what do we got? We got a rock accelerator. I could use that instead of this guy's other artillery. Is this artillery better than the one that he has? Hmm. If I get the buildings immune, this could be not horrible. You think the repair push is worse skill? Yeah, I, I hate it. I, for one reason, I forget about it all the time. I think I like the rock better because we can use it to block Vex spawning. So I think I might sell the cluster artillery and just use this instead. Yeah, let's go ahead and do that. Do that. Sell that guy. And then if we give him two cores, we can make that do three damage. Um, do I want the ally immune on this guy? Probably get that. I don't know if we'll do the plus one damage on this yet. I think I'd like to get ally immune damage on that. Okay, so. Smoke bombs. Oh, repulse though. That's also very good. Because that gets the shield self and shield friendly. Do I want that instead of the grav well? Pulse is really good. If I got that, and sold the uh, sold this thing, I would have ten, which means I'd still be able to get three power. I'd have to use one to power that, one to shield self. I wouldn't be able to get the plus one damage on that. I really like repulse though. This is one of my favorite science skills actually. You know what, I'm gonna get this, sell this. We're gonna totally change up our weapon setup. Basically, Judoka, you've just gotten a rework. Okay, all right. So I'm gonna need two there, and two there. So I think we're just gonna get, well, maybe I just do one here to shields. Well, shield self doesn't stack with this his shield, so I would want shield friendly is what I want. Thanks, Dehydrated Bot. You're a bro. So we got shield friendly. I'd need two there, and I wouldn't need two there. Let's see how we want to distribute these. Is it repair? Push and the repulse the same thing, basically. Um, yes, but the reason that this one is so good is because you can actually shield with it. You upgrade it and be shields, you can shield your bros. It's the shield that really makes it worth it. Because you can shield buildings, which is, and your own guys, it's amazing. So I'm actually going to give him the shield friendly. Because he's already got a self shield. Although I guess if I... Shield self could be not bad, it basically regen a shield if you lost it. Have I seen Pix Arc? No, what is, what is that? What is Pix Arc? Actually, if I lose your move, I can get the plus one damage. Beautiful. So now we have three damage there. Shield friendly. And nothing on you. All right. Cool. All right. Let's continue to do the ones that are slightly easier. I might just get try to get a two island win here. It's a new version of Arc. Okay. Um, with pixels? Yeah, I do know Arc. I mean, me and Shogi play... Um, Sometimes play uh, Dark and Light, which is basically Arc. Fantasy version of Arc. Defend the prototype, Renfield Bombs. Well, since I have Shield Ally, I feel like we have a pretty good shot at doing this one. Alright, you give extra health or regen? You give regen. You have four health. Okay. Alright, so you probably go over there, so I'll probably want to just throw you somewhere. And we'll put you here because you can shield both of these things if we need to. Dark would like Minecraft in regards to block graphics. <laughs> Have they even finished Dark yet? That's a good question. That's one of those games that's going to be um, in development forever, I feel like. Ooh, actually, if I throw you there, you do... How much damage do you do? 
two. So you'll do three to both those guys. But you attack last. But I like that. I like using you to kill both those guys. So what I think I'm going to do is first... Ah, oh, man, if I give shields to both those things, that'll that'll put that one in the way. So how about I do this? I give a shield to you. Bang those guys together. And I can throw a rock here and block that spawn. Let's do that. And this, this guy should... Make that guy kill both those dudes. If I... Yes, he will. Awesome. Block that spawn. Spawn. Beautiful. All right. Ark has been full released. Okay. I know I've seen people playing it. And I know I've seen things that weren't there in the game when I played it. But that's pretty cool. Pix Pixark. Is that like... Is it a mod, Shogi? Or is it a totally new game? Pix Pixark. Is it... Completely new game or what? And all I have to do is defend the bombs, so. Throw a rock there, and that'll make you block that. Go here and do a shield there. block some spawns here it's a completely new game okay sweet I'll have to check it out it's on I assume it's on Steam we do no damage to this guy but that's okay just playing the defensive game here sweet Let me check it out Interesting. Cool. I'll check that out later, sir. Oh, and I see your I see your uh, direct messages. Awesome. Oakley Dokley. Could use this guy to kill this guy, but he's going last, so that doesn't actually help us. This guy goes first. Um, let me see here. Could just outright kill you, though, right? Yes, I can. kill this guy. I basically need to pull this guy one over. Which my only way to do that is to... I don't have a way to do that actually since I got rid of his repulse thingy. But I could use this guy to kill that guy. If I do this. Or if I do this, that'll knock him over, and he'll die from that. Okay. I'll just throw you there. He'll do new, no damage. I don't get to block any spawns again, though. No blocking spawns for me. How'd you find out about that game? Did you see somebody streaming it, Shogi? Oh, okay, but we do get this guy to attack that guy. Nah, he'll be dead first. Oh, well. Right. Is it out or is it early release? Let me see here. It is early access game. Alright, you're attacking... Nothing cool. All right, so I can just go ahead and kill you with this guy if I want. If I need to do that, uh, let's see if 
I were to go, I can't go here. That's actually protected, so we're actually fine here. As long as we kill this guy, we take no damage. So just getting experience is what we'd like to do. And the best way to do that would be getting, getting these guys to kill each other. So how could I do that? With these two guys. You would do only two damage to this guy if I knocked him over, so that would not be lethal. Stripping. Uh, is that a streamer, I guess? <laughs> so I do that, you take one. If I could push that guy over then, it would be enough to kill him. What's the cloud on the map? The cloud is anytime this sand tile gets attacked, turns into smoke, and if an, a unit is in smoke, it can't attack, and it also cancels attacks in smoke. So, it's basically a status effect that cancels an attack. Alright, we know we're doing this. Let's go do that. I don't think I'm going to be able to get any more kills here. Looks like it's just not going to work out. Throw you... You thought I've watched Strippin' before? Maybe I have. Was he the guy that you watched uh, playing... Um... I've already moved you and canceled. Apparently I did. Alright, well, we're just going to do that. Um... But we watched play... Um... See there, that attacked... His, that, that canceled his attack by doing that. See the guy we watched... Uh, that you were watching that got you all excited about um, Vermintide 2. Okay, yeah, yeah. Cool. Wow, that guy definitely plays a lot of different types of games then. <laughs> okay, alright. Not too shabby. Defend the train. Take less than three grid damage. We got a lightning storm. Alright, let's go for this one. So that guy's got five health. You have two health. I can one-shot you with pretty much only my artillery, dude. And you can shield stuff. So let's get you here to block. Block and shield. Flump, flump, flump. I've been reading uh, the book I'm... The books I'm currently reading, series I'm reading, is one of those... Um, called Lit RPG, which is basically, um, it's basically books that are stories about people playing, um, um, uh, MMOs <laughs> is basically what it is. You might end up buying this game. You love Minecraft type survival games. I do know. I do know. Let's see, if I were to push that guy. Actually, hold on a sec. I could just throw this guy. He'll hit that mountain. And I throw a rock here. Nope, that won't work. I'd have to throw a rock from this direction, which I can't do. Could I move this guy? I don't think I can with the way these lightning things move. Damn. What's the name of the book? Um, well, there's a bunch of different ones. The one that I'm reading right now, the series is called the Cartos. What's it called? The Cartos. Way. No, it's called Way of the Shaman. Way of the Shaman is the series. It's kind of hard. The reading is not the best on this one because I think it was originally written Russian, written in Russian, and it's uh, been translated to English. So the translations are not the best. Uh, but there's a bunch of books like this this series that I've read. So you got 300 plus hours in Terraria, which is a lot for you. Nice. If I do this, do you die? You do die if I do that. Or I do that. Block that, move you out of the way. Oh, <laughs> Pink Floyd just did the uh, 
Just gave the link for her. Hey, what's up, Peeler Witch? How are you doing? Check them out on Amazon? Nice. If I do that, it's not that much damage. Sorry about the timeout, uh, Pink Floyd. <laughs> okay, three damage. Would I have a way to finish him after doing that? That's only one damage. Damn, this guy, why do you gotta do so much damage, bro? I'm doing great. Just got the game, it's so good. Yeah, this game's a lot of fun. This game is definitely a lot of fun. So we can one shot you, which I don't I don't even need to do that because you're gonna just die from the lightning. My issue is dealing with this guy who would just do so much damage here. And I can't throw him. Okay, well I can just throw him this way. There we go. That'll stop the damage. So if I do that, I do three damage. I throw him, I do one more damage, he'll be at one health, he'll heal for one because of this guy can block this. Alright, let's do that. Hopefully this will do what I hope it does. <laughs> Please do what I want you to do. Alright, there we go. Nice. Okay, cool. Yes, I know he's not doing anything. He's just gonna block spawn. Block a spawn. Get spawn blocked. Death by lightning. What a way to go. What a way to go. You only realize now that this is that it, that that is a custom squad. The group I'm playing is not a custom squad. Um, however, I have played a number of custom squads. Okay, so that would that would kill him. Wouldn't actually block that shot. Kill that guy. Yes, that'll... Uh, the lightning will happen first, so the shot will still go through. That's fine. <laughs> okay, cool. Now, this is the Judoka. I'm playing the Steel Judoka. This is the group I'm playing right now. Uh, although, the weapon setup... I changed two of the guy's weapons, so it actually kind of makes it look like a custom squad. Because normally this guy would not throw rocks, and normally this guy would not have the um, the thing that pushes guys away. It also shields your allies. So, well, crap. Okay, so I can kill that guy, which will free him. Then just get out of the way, I guess. Maybe move on, block this spawn, and have this guy move block that spawn. Seems pretty good. We'll do that. Wish I could move this guy here. Not that guy that way, but oh well. Still can block a decent amount of spawns here. Here, shield that mountain. Ah, it doesn't work. Can't shield mountains, apparently. You can shield... You can set... You can ice mountains, I think. I think I've done something to mountains before. Don't remember what. I've done some status effect to mountains, I think. Do, 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 do. I right, kill you with my artillery. I can just dodge out of the way. Let's see. This guy does one damage. If I still have the buff to the passive damage they do to each other, we could make them one of those kill the other. Not quite able to do that. Alright, definitely do that. That's from the Steel Judoka, suckers! Alright. Um, yeah, I don't think I have any way to kill any of these guys, so just do nothing. Let these guys shoot each other for fun. They'll at least do two damage to each other. <laughs> I 
<laughs> Stop punching yourself. Stop punching yourself. Personal favorite is the two ice cannon and a laser mech with the fawn and ice mech to get immune, so it's self ice effect. Then you just freeze everything and win. Oh, yes. Or you could go crazy mode and have three ice guys. That's actually what I got my first um, custom squad hard mode four island win on. And I got max score on it because I lost nothing by um, uh, f just freezing everything. And I had Nafon in one of them. It's great. Kill seven enemies, defend both solar farms. I feel like we could do this. We should have the damage, I think. Oh, that is a lot of alphas. No, sir, I don't like it. Okay, so you're definitely going to shoot this way. So I'm going to have to move you or something to deal with you. If I could throw you. Let me see. What's your movement, movement range? And I'm going to want to one-shot you. Let me see what your movement range is going to be. Oh, yeah, you'll be able to move plenty to throw that guy. Okay. Hopefully, he'll move there. He can move you there and throw you into the water. would be ideal. You, if you go there, you'll wrap up one of these guys. So let's move you there. And you there so none of my guys can get wrapped up. Okay, let's see what happens here. You just went with a laser mech in case of a kill X enemies mission. Yes. That was my main issue. I didn't actually get perfect islands, but I got a perfect score. Because the only thing it requires to get a perfect score is that you don't let any civilians die the entire run. So that's what that's how my ran my run at ended up going. Damn it, man. But yeah, it's pretty fun to do builds like that. All right, let's see here. Could just absorb this shot. What am I gonna do about these guys down here? Ah, the music's so good. If I were to go there and throw that guy, he would shoot that stuff. Believe. Actually, no, he wouldn't. His attack gets canceled because of the, the smoke stuff there. Okay. Actually, I could just let him attack because that'll kill that guy. We only take one damage except we get acid on ourselves. Am I okay with getting acid on myself to have this guy die? I think I might be okay with that. Could I already the big guy in the water? No, I don't have the uh, I don't have the movement range for it. I can't even shoot this guy with that. I might actually just let him shoot my own guy to kill that guy. I'll have acid, but that might set up for... I don't know. Uh, what I could do, though, is move here, shield both these buildings, kill this guy. Move here and kill this guy. I lose my armor from the acid. Yeah, but I can repair and get my armor back. If you repair and remove the acid, you get your armor back. So I'm I'm fine with that. He still only takes one. He takes one and then the acid applies. I think is how that works. But I think we're gonna find out. We're gonna we're gonna do that. We're just gonna allow that hit to happen. Cause I'm curious about the interaction. It should do one damage. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I'm fine with that. Maybe I'll even get lucky and the guy walks in his own acid. Lice. Which means now I can throw a rock at him and just one-shot him, I believe. So if I do that, you're just dead, sir. Awesome. Uh, let's see here. I'm not going to do one damage to you. It's not much. Uh, hey, uh, hey, what's up, Uncaged Unicorn? How you doing, my friend? If I go here, we block that shot. And we also make him block that spawn.
what I want to do with this guy. I might just want to repair him and block this shot. Yeah, we're going to have a lot of Vec on here. I got to kill seven enemies. I will kill one right now. You'll take one damage. Yeah, let's go do this. Kill you. Got to kill four more dudes in two turns. My damage is not amazing on this group, so I need to get these Vec to shoot each other. Is what I need to do. See, we did get our we did get our armor back, so we took zero damage from that when we repaired. All right, see if we can get these guys. Here we go. Here we go. That's what I'm talking about. All right, so. If I go there, I can make him block that shot, and this guy will kill him. Um, Outright kill that guy. Throw this guy, and he will do only damage to my own dude. Like it. Like it. I block no spawns, but we do get a couple kills. And actually, if I do the timing right, I give this guy a shield and make him not even get hit. Even better. Beautiful. Like it. Like it. Right, I need to kill two more guys this final turn. Got some low health dudes, so that shouldn't be an issue. Mm, maybe it will be an issue. Alright, let's see here. If I do that, he dies. If I go there, I can block that shot. If I move that guy in front of this guy, he'll do two damage because of the bonus, right? Plus one damage, so this will do one plus one. So that'll kill that guy. So that'll just barely, that'll barely complete all my objectives, I believe. Beautiful. And just prepare yourself for fun. All right, nice. I feel like I'm getting better at the Steel Judoka. They were one of the harder groups when I first started playing this game. So I feel like I'm getting a better feel for it. All right. Nice. Give me that core. Give me that core. All right, I want to put that on this thing so it does the bonus damage again. Yeah, let's go ahead and do that. Mafon is so good. Oh, yeah, he is. Mafon is... He, he is pretty much the guy I've been taking from timeline to timeline after I got all the uh, bonus things done already. You hate this mech group, just no damage. You're right, Lego Pirate. You are right. That's why I actually changed this guy to the Rock Accelerator. And I changed this guy to Repulse because I feel like it's got more utility. Alright, do we want to defend the train? I do have shield. I feel like defending the train is just too much of a trap here. We've got a perfect thing going on, so let's not wreck it with the train. All right, so I feel like when they have this open hole, we're going to have more guys spawning in there. I think guys like to spawn out of there. So I can one-shot that guy with my artillery rock dude. Uh, let's see. Where are you going to go? kind of doesn't matter where you go, because as long as I can shoot you with my artillery guy... Well, actually, it does kind of matter, because... I'll have to put my artillery guy right. There's not a place where this guy cannot reach us. Well, that's kind of bull BS right there. That's pretty BS. Well, let's hope we get him to go right here. Because then I can just throw him right into the, the great abyss here. So hope for that. If you go there, this guy can shield. Shield stuff here. All right. But yeah, Lego Pirate. That's kind of why I put this group off as one of my last ones to try to get a... a um, Hard mode went on. Okay, look at all those dudes. Ooh. 
Could shield both these things while killing this guy so we get rid of the heal. What would I do with you then? Just do some damage to you. But you're right, the damage on these guys is uh, pretty ridiculously bad. Pretty ridiculously bad. Maybe I actually would prefer to kill this guy. No, that wouldn't kill him. Let's get rid of the uh, guy that gives us passive bonuses. Gives them passive bonuses. Heal up or, or block those shots. How much damage do you do? You do five. Okay, we don't want to eat that then. I'll just shield that. Do that. Yeah, attack the shielded thing. That's cool, man. Right, if I throw this guy, damn, it'll cancel his attack. I actually want him to attack that. Although I can kill him by doing that. And throwing him. But I don't prevent, prevent that damage. I think I just killed that guy. Throw that guy. At least when you're being screwed in this game, the music is great. Yes, we do have that to enjoy. <laughs> that that'll actually kill that guy okay nice we get another shield on there hey my fun with the level up now oh, gave him grid defense I don't really care about that but all right you're back now on steam while you play nice on steam while you play eh? wow they really don't like this guy yikes could we have more alphas please all right well we can just one shot that guy That'll ram that dude. So I'll lose my shield. I could throw him first. Dealing with this guy. Well, if I don't lose my shield, then I can just shield that, and then my own personal shield will protect us. Yeah, that's what we're going to do so we don't lose my fan. at it. Then we shield this building here. Will this hold? It'll hold. Hold, damn you, hold. Have I played with a secret team? Yes, I have. Wait, why did he just... Oh, did that... <laughs> I even did something I didn't mean to do. I actually got that guy to kill that guy. Beautiful. I mean, totally planned. <laughs> I love it when things go into a plan that I forget to plan for, that the plan works out. Um, yes, I actually got my first hardwood win with three islands last, um, last week, so. Alright, you're attacking there, you're attacking there. So I can just go here, stop that attack. And actually that'll make that guy kill that guy. Do damage to that guy, I won't kill him. But I can shield this and we take no damage, I believe. Beautiful, man. I love it when a plan comes together. Yes, Secret Squad is my least favorite squad, though. I feel like they're horrible. Like, until you get them damaged, and even when you get the damage, the, the um, utility on them, I just I don't like the way their attacks work. So, Wow, did he get promoted twice, or did I get two separate promotions? Okay, I got two separate promotions. Nice. 
Okay. So you got mech H you got mech HP and you got grid defense. Not the bonuses I was hoping for. Yeah, definitely not a fan of the secret squad. Super secret squad. Alright, we're gonna have to kill this guy so that his heals stop, so. The only guy who can one-shot this guy is my artillery. That guy can move around so much. Um, I'm hoping, hoping he would go here and I could throw him out there. And I'm hoping that this guy will be able to push this guy away from... Probably go there, actually. What's your attack? Is it... It's three forwards. You could actually you could actually go here and hit those two things. So if I go here, I'd be able to push him out of that. All right, all right. We'll see. We'll see what happens here. Show me what those mechs of yours can do. Okay. Well, if we can get these guys to attack each other. That would be the best. How can I get these guys to attack each other? So that guy would do... Oh, wait a sec. This guy would do seven damage? That guy would one-shot this guy. Okay, I think I have to do something here. I think I have to sacrifice some civilians. Because this is just too good an opportunity to not to, to pass up. Basically, I move this guy over. He one shots this guy. This guy's attack will go off, so I'll lose one of these. But if I shield, if I shield this, I only lose one. I only take one core damage for this. And in the meantime, this guy can block a spawn. Yes. We can one-shot the boss here. That is an opportunity I do not want to miss. There we go. We take one grid damage that has a chance of being blocked. We took one-shot the boss. I like it. I like it. Hey, we did resist it. Get one shot, bro. <laughs> oh, that was pretty awesome. Uh, that's cool, man. That's cool. Right. Make so they don't heal anymore. Uh, if I throw that guy there, he will actually do grid damage to us. So. But he'll also block a spawn. Well, if I'm not worried about that guy healing, what I could do is just do this. Block a couple spawns. Although I don't want. Hmm. Alright, what if I kill this guy, freeze him? He can go there and block that spawn. And shield that. And he can throw that guy a block the spawn, and that won't take damage. Yeah. Uh, how much move do you have? Four. One, two, three. You'll be able to get there. Sweet. Go there. This will make my own guy take damage, sadly, but it's okay. It's okay. We shield that and take no grid damage. You're playing two rock throwers plus an ice mech on a freeze and defend robot mission. Pretty broken. But you able to just block all the spawns. Oh, no! <laughs> I killed my fan. Damn it. Why did he... Oh, no. Talk about a misplay. I freaking got my fan killed. I didn't think of this guy's shot being AoE. Damn it, what a freaking bad play that was. Oh, man. Freaking wrecked myself. God damn. 
Damn it, damn it, damn it. Rip my fan. Frickin' rip. Oh, that makes me so sad. That makes me so sad. What a frickin' misplay right there. I wish reset turn. What's the point of going back in time if you can only go back in time one minute? You know? Damn it, man. This should let you go back a turn. Ah, lay, man. Well, I guess all I lose is the shield and the power. Which is enough. God, that sucks. Alright, well, this is the last turn, so I just need to not take damage, which... I don't know if I have a way to not take damage. Because he would still hit that. Uh, actually, if I throw you... There, you would actually that would cancel your attack. Okay, that works. Well, my fan's legacy lives on with a shield that's protecting our corporate tower. My, my fan, Maffin, we you will be remembered. Oh man, <laughs> that was such a bad play. Uh, freaking killed him. Rip infinite shield though. Yeah. I'm so sorry. KIA. But you died saving civilians. God, that sucks. Uh, oh, hey, but we get this girl who can't be webbed and has extra mech reactor. So, <laughs> upgrade. Okay, not really an upgrade because the shield is so good. But <laughs> at, least we, uh, at least we got somebody who has mech reactor on her. So. All right. How easy will it be to recruit him again? Well, he's in my, uh, he's in my, uh, when you start a new run, you can choose one special pilot, and he's in my barracks or whatever you call it, so I can, I can choose him at any time. Uh, well, for my next run, not any time. Gemini missiles. So weird. I've never used that item. I can get shield self on that as well. That's true. Which I could get that right now if I wanted. I really want to give this guy damage, though. But I need to give three reactor cores for that. I don't have enough for that. Well, I know we're getting two of these. Do I want to get this passive? It's going to be powered. It's free. He's not dead for my barracks. No, no. Right, I guess we'll just do that. All right, where do we put it? Do we do get the shield self? And then, maybe plus one move on this guy. Maybe we go for three islands. Because this run's going decently, I think I might actually go for three islands here. So, we're going to give you one. Get the shield self. And that kind of makes up for it. And then we give you one. Draw ally immune. No, I just want to get the move. Yeah. And we're working towards getting plus two damage here. Good. One more island to try. Hopefully we won't die. Let's check out what the islands are, though. Spider or spider guy is in the level. Charge dude in the thing. The guy that throws the bombs. God, I hate the bomb guys. Um, I guess this one's not horrible. This one's not horrible, I guess. Let's go for the ice one. All right, in battle, listen for mech damage. Defend the robots. All right, we'll start with defending some ro robots. Defend the robots. That is a lot of alphas. Let us hope that one of them will freeze themselves. So we can one-shot that guy with artillery. And then we'll need to shield guys, probably. So I won't be able to throw these guys, though. So we need to throw this this way, probably. You here, and four move. Guess we'll have you go there. All right. Got to. You just gotta stop Vex spawning mission. <laughs> Those are the best with the ice dudes and the rock dudes that you have. Do, do, do. 
Wow. Okay. Okay, that is a lot of stuff going on here. Well, at least they aren't attacking the robots, I guess. Okay, what I can do is kill that guy. No, not you. I can kill that guy and free him. That'll actually make him attack that guy. How much damage do you do? Three plus one. That'll actually deal with both of these, that guy and that guy. That's great. The issue is, I can't throw that guy, so I can't do damage to this guy to stop him from doing damage there. So, I actually can't stop this damage here. So I think I have to shield one and not shield the other, I guess. Oh, that kind of sucks. This, this guy is... Kinda useless. Kinda useless this uh this one. Alright, well we'll do what we can. We'll block the damage on some of them, and then we'll just block this. Block a spawn, sadly. So we're gonna take up to two damage here. Hope for a resist, but probably not. That's awesome though, I like that. Damn. Sorry, civilians. We have no direct damage except for my artillery guy. And that's what I was hoping for, so I could actually throw you out of the way. Alright, so I could ice get that guy on ice. Throw throw you after that guy's moved. And make you submerge here. And that'll also shield that thing. Nice, like it. I will take damage. How much damage will it take? Two plus fire. Well, that's not the best. I could have actually thrown him into the ice. You know what? Let's let's change that. I could have done it better. I could have done this. Use these traps. Yeah, let's do that. We we'll take less damage. I should have I should have just done that without doing this re turn reset. That was a mistake. We won't need any more resets. I think that's only the first or second reset I've used this run, though, so. Alright, somebody step on ice. How about you, spider guy? You want to step on any of these things? They look really inviting to me. Nice. Okay. We got one guy to step on it. I like it. Oh, and she's immune to that. <laughs> Alright. Alright, not bad. Alright, we can kill you. Move you. Your max levels. Is there any way I can kill you with anybody else? No. Okay. Oh man, that would. That actually kill that guy. He'll get shielded and he'll get knocked in that. And he'll actually die. So can't do that. Now we can throw that. We can go block this and shield up our guy. All right, so all we have is the spider guy and one spawn to worry about. I love these ice trap dudes. Oh, crap. Well, okay. Uh, all right, that's right. Well, I put you on ice. Kill you. I could kill you, and you could go here and do nothing because you have no damage. So let's just do that. Sadly, I keep getting experience on the guy who is max on experience, and I actually can't stop that. All right, so just repair yourself. Okay. All right, GG. Nice. Good start. I think we took uh, two grid damage there. Could have been Weiss. Could have been Weiss. So I need to get two more cores so this person doesn't do one freaking damage. Block back spawning three times. Break five buildings out of the ice. Protect the power generator. All right. 
I think we can do this one. These guys will help me with breaking stuff out of the ice. Especially since we have all this AoE stuff. Although it is a spider guy, which I hate that guy. I hate that guy. Alright. So these guys can go up here. You can go there. So as long as I don't put anybody there, he won't be able to do anything next turn, uh, the first turn. So... you up here and I think you can shield buildings even in the ice so I'm gonna want to kill that guy if I can this is a lot of Vec I'm gonna have to deal with here all right this guy's probably just gonna go around from building to building icing stuff or uh, shielding stuff it's probably what's gonna end up happening but I do have to block Ve Vex spawning three times. Need to see if I can do that. Chipil, Chip Chipili, Chipili, two. However you say your name, I'm sorry I can't say it correctly. Thank you so much for the follow. I appreciate it, my friend. Welcome to the stream. Oh man, don't block my, my face. So, if I do that. I knock that guy in there, destroy the spider thing, free this guy. Decent chunk of damage to much of those guys. I won't be able to stop this guy, however. I would then be able to move this guy to finish off one of these. Mm, I don't know if I'll be able to finish off either of those guys because the damage is so low. What's your move? Oh, you have eight move. Okay, yeah, you can finish off the spider for sure. Let's do that. It's a good bunch of AoE there. Yeah. This person can literally move to the entire map. That is crazy. The entire stinking map. Okay. Um, I'd love to. Do I want to let you knock those things out of ice? You know what? I think I might allow that. I'll allow it. Um, although I don't know that I want you to knock the generator out of ice. Ooh, what I can do is use you to block, though. Block a spawn. Yeah, let's do that. We'll let you break that stuff out of ice. Kill you so we get no more spider eggs. All right. And that gets uh, one Vex spawn blocked. We need to do two more and break out three more buildings. Got to block two more Vex spawns. I'm pressing one. No, I'm pressing two, apparently. All right, that'll knock you out of that. Um, let's see here. You're attacking down. way to block another Vex spawn here. If I throw you and then knock you that way, that will actually get you to block that. You'll also... Actually, you won't block because this guy will kill you? No, you won't. This guy will do one damage to you. Two. How much damage will he do to you? He'll do two damage to you. So you will die from that, so you won't block the spawn. All right. Um, hmm. How much damage do you do? You do three. So that would actually kill this guy. All right, I think I might actually just allow that damage. I'll give you a shield, and you'll block that. I'm just letting all these Vec live is what I'm not loving about this thing right now. But I have to stop that up there. And that guy's not attacking the ice buildings. How many more buildings? I need to break out three more, so this will do one. All right, I am going to allow that. 
Okay, all right. All right, do this. Gives you a shield. You repair yourself. Do that damage. We'll have to block one more Vex spawning and break out through two more buildings. Egg and Bomb Lairs are the most obnoxious enemies, I agree. Yikes, that was more damage than I thought it was going to take. Yikes, okay. Well, we didn't die, at least. But yeah, I agree, because the... Um, any, any unit that creates more units is so difficult to deal with. Alright, so you're going to break, break that out. Yikes. This is what I was afraid of. Too much stuff happening all at once. I can let that guy break that out. Oh, well, I can't get the block Vex spawning because there's just too many Vex. Oh, wait. There is... Okay, so if I just allow this to happen, I will block this. He'll break that out of the ice. The issue becomes, how do I deal with the rest of this stuff? I can't kill that guy. I can shield this, but I will take damage here. So, we will get all the ice stuff broken out of, but we're just going to take a bunch of core damage right now, too, though. Uh, okay, I can ignore that guy, actually. So, I can kill this guy. Shield this building. I'll take one damage here. And this will be broken out. And that should be okay. And we will have completed the Vec and the Breaking Stuff Out quest. So we're basically just allowing some damage to happen here to get these quests done. Every little bit helps. And then you're going to repair. All right. Kill the wor worm, shield the open building. Kill the worm. Well, that would have still been damaged because this, this guy that I just killed would have done this. So basically what I did was similar to what you just said. Since there were... Three different guys attacking these things. Actually, killing the worm would have been better. Because that guy was only attacking one thing. You're right, that would have been better. Still got the quest done, but we took one extra core damage there. Damn. Yikes. Okay. Um... can't actually kill both these guys. Uh, and I can't shield this building for some reason. Is this guy in the... You have four. One, two, three. If I throw you, I could shield one of these buildings. Um, damn, it sucks that the throw guy just can't do anything to these guys. That really sucks. damage you do you to one all right so we want to kill the guy that does more damage throw this guy so that you can move here and shield that that's the best we can do but you're right pink floyd i think uh what you had said would have been better damn it we took a lot of damage this run this this thing just too much aoe shit and the uh the damn the guys that Burrow are like the counter to this group because I have two guys that can actually do zero damage to them, which really, really sucks. One move, one mech. This guy comes with reactor. Um, if he doesn't move, he can attack twice. Which of these will I... I guess that's best on this guy. Double shot. You know what, I don't think I'm going to power that because uh, I really want to get the damage on this guy. So I'm going to stall. We'll get, I guess, ally immune for now. Because health, I don't feel like, will be that huge there. All right, well, I'm going to have to do this one anyway. So let's do this one first. 
because it's blocking my access to these other maps. Yeah, this, this group I have really gets wrecked by these dudes right here. All right, so I'm going to want to one-shot this one, I think, and then this one tried to shield whatever he... Uh, actually, the only thing I'll be able to attack will be that one, which is already shielded, so... You... We'll also try to attack that over there, so. Unless I get him to try to attack one of my guys over here. Can't wrap him. So, uh. Thank you for the uh Mighty Toad Man. What a name. Thank you so much for the follow, my friend. I appreciate it. Welcome to the stream. Welcome to the stream. Man, a lot of new folks following today. It's awesome. Must be a lot of people checking out uh, Into the Breach. Hey, there we go. Attack stuff I can just dodge. Let's see here. So I can just one-shot you, which I definitely want to do. You're back yet to cook some food for your little bro? Gotta cook that bro food. Love to block some Vex spawning. Do I have any way of doing that? Where are you attacking? There. No, I can't get that guy to hit that guy. Unless I was able to move this guy certain direction too found you on saturday through your youtube channel oh nice nice a lot of people have been following on youtube recently i i don't know where all the youtube uh recent activity has been coming from but it's awesome love it glad you guys are uh, enjoyed the youtube enough to come check out the my actual twitch channel it's really cool man go there go there go there a lot of people seem to come here after they see some of the FTL pods. Yeah, which mean, makes me go, hmm, maybe I should play some more FTL, but <laughs> I just don't want to play FTL right now, so. <laughs> this is the sequel to FTL. I missed you. Wait, what? Oh, you missed, uh, you missed Hydrated Bot. Stay Hydrated Bot, yeah. I know. Me too. <laughs> All right, let's see here. We can cancel that guy's attack. Um, gosh, how am I going to get here? Could just um, block that while killing this guy. I think that might be what I do, actually. Uh, you were like one of the first results when we looked up to FTL playthroughs? Really? Wow. I guess my YouTube channel videos are getting more... Uh, Getting more viewership, which is awesome. I was, uh, for a while, I was really good about getting all my FTL uh, VODs transferred over there. So, you found me on YouTube after watching some of my no pods FTL runs. That's awesome, Mighty Toad, man. That's so cool. So cool, man. All right, where are you going? Oh, don't wrap me up, bro. Oh, stop wrapping me up, bros. Okay, okay. Um, this is pretty bad. If I free you, we can ignore this guy because that thing's shielded. If I knock you over, you have one, two, three, four. Enough move to get that guy. Okay. Then we can throw this guy. All right, I think we have to do this. Stop wrapping up my bros. It's not cool to wrap up bros unless they ask for being wrapped up by bros. This isn't seriously wrapping. This is... <laughs> oh, man. Oh, man. Why, why you gotta make it all pun-like? Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Hey, you're immune to wrapping. Okay, nice. Beautiful. So this guy can just push those guys back. You cannot quite kill this guy, though. Um, let me see here. 
but you can... Damn, I don't have a way to move this guy because of the rock's way of moving. You had not punted in a while, so you thought, why the hell not? I'll tell you why the hell not. <laughs> Just say no to puns. That's why the hell not. Hold on a sec. Can I move... Yes, I can move that guy. So, if I go here, move that guy. Okay, I think I can actually take no damage here. Yeah, you'll have enough move. You have to be creative here. That'll free him. Ah, they block his move there, though, now. Damn it. Thought I'd find a way to do it. Okay. Well, we pretty much almost die if we don't stop this damage. So I have to stop this damage. Oh, wait. I can still do this. So I do that. Stops that damage. Do that. Stops that damage. And then just throw you and I won't take the damage. All right. All right. We can still, we're still fine. Everything turned out better than expected. Butamus. All right. Cool. And that's the final turn. Took no grid damage, which is very good because we have very little grid health right now. You have returned. Welcome back, Healer Witch. Welcome back. Did you bring food for the whole class? I have cookies. If we get a win, I'm having a cookie. If we don't win, I'm still having a cookie. I'm telling you. Cookie time is happening. Freeze and defend both robots. Protect the robotics lab. I think I could do this one. I think I can. We're gonna go for it. We are gonna go for it. Ah, freaking spider dude. Alright, alright. It's not as bad as some other dudes. Um, I, the only guy I can one shot is this guy. Yeah, I can understand why uh, people don't like this group. Just the damn, just so low. So low damage. At least these guys can't move far. So you can't wrap up anybody. And you cannot. Okay, so none of these guys can hit anything. Except this guy can shoot a spider web. So if I can, like, one-shot this guy plus spider web or something, that would be great. Um, Let me see here. Oh, I don't want this guy to get wrapped up, so we're going to move him one back there. All right, all right. Let's see what we can do here, man. Let's see. I am not super optimistic about this level. Many lives depend on you. Many Bothans died to bring us this information. All right, so I could... Freeze this guy, push that guy across, and shield this thing. Do I have any way to kill that guy? Yeah, so that'll, that'll save that guy. I'll shield that. I'll have to decide what I want to do with that guy. So let's go do this first. Do that. This guy does not take that damage. I can kill you. Or I can block off the spawn. Do I kill a guy or keep one guy from spawning? I think killing a guy is better. No, you don't have food. Oh, man. No food. Okay, you'll share some food. Oh, Desert Eagle's got the food. <laughs> Everybody spam Desert Eagle. Okay, we can block this. We can do both. Beautiful. All right, nice. All right, good turn one. I like it. I do have a spider to deal with, though. Oh, delicious cookies. How's he going to freeze those robots? Uh, you get this. You're given one freeze tank for this level. You are given a freeze tank. That's how you do it. Yikes, man. All right, so. This guy's move is four. One, two, 
So getting to this guy is going to be the issue now. I need to get here, so I need to move this guy. If I just throw this guy, that'll make me not able to do it because this guy will be in the way. But then I could push my own guy. Yes, I think we can do this somehow. Do I accept this damage? I really don't want to accept more damage. You just ate carbonara, so take it back. Oh, that sounds delicious. Sounds delicious. All right, so they'll free me. Damn it. Okay, if I go here, nope. If I go here, that'll block the ice shot. Actually, if I just move out of the way, you're going to shoot this thing, right? We'll actually, we can let him kill the spider. Make him work for us. Let's make him work for us. And I'll freeze this spider. And I can, um... Push these guys? Does that do me any good? Pushing those guys around? Not really. But that's that's actually fine. Now we can kill, but that does let us kill this guy. So we don't get any more spiders. I like that a lot. All right, let's do that. No more spiders. Kill you. Freeze that spider. All right, we take no core damage. Beautiful. Sounds delicious, but you need a dessert. There you go. Cookie for dessert. <laughs> You'll give everyone who drops a pun 10 cookies. Oh, man. Why you gotta, why you gotta encourage that? Puns should never be encouraged. Puns should never be encouraged. I love the immune to wrapping. That is so good. All right, so we got... That'll let us get these guys frozen. Um... That guy has so much health. All right, I think we need to kill that guy to get rid of some of that health. Yeah, let's do that. All right, now you only have four. Puns are so punny. That one is well known, but you still you have promised it. Oh God, don't! Why are you rewarding this? Oh my God, don't! Don't reward that. Um, let's see here. If I if I do a pushback here. That actually kills that guy, and that's not a good thing. So, I guess we just dodge out of the way of this. Can I shield anything? I can shield that bot. All right, we'll do that. Repair. Okay, all right. And you have not done anything yet, so just re you can't do anything. All right. Uh, what did the grape say when it was crushed? Nothing. It just let, let out a little wine. You liked that one? <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, man. This is this is not something that should be encouraged. Stop, stop encouraging this. All right, let's see. Can we freeze anything? We actually can freeze that guy if I move this guy out of the way. Uh, but I can't do that because if I knock that guy that way, that guy gets knocked there. Which is not good. Okay, we could do this. Then we take the damage from that guy. Whoops. We could do that. Which means he hits... He hits that guy, which is not good. We could do this, which means he hits that, which is not good. Damn it. Puns are essential for a good, fulfilling life. I, I don't think that's a true statement. I would have to disagree with that statement. I can shoot that there. 
That'll get that guy out of that. I can just move out of the way of this guy and, like, shield some stuff. This is the guy I'm worried about here. How do I deal with this guy? It's a victory in one turn. Oh, if I shield... Okay, here we go. If I throw him here... This thing will actually be shielded, so we're fine. So if I do this... Yes. sec. Still knocks that guy into a place I don't want him to go. Alright, if I go here and freeze that, go here and shield that. Oh, actually, hold on a second. If I do this, then I can throw that guy in the water. There we go. As long as I can move there, yes. Okay, cool. Now we're good. Took us a bit, but we got there. Have a nice trip. See you next fall. All right, there. I just did puns. There we go. Do I get cookies? I said, have a nice trip. See you next fall when I push them in the water. Can I have cookies? Every pun lowers lifespan by one month. <laughs> You play so many games I've never heard of. I've been living under a rock. Bolt. <laughs> I don't know about a rock, but I do play a lot of different games. This is an amazing game. It's a very good game. It's a lot of fun. I have very low power grid for this final thing here. Um, if you're not really that big in a strategy, this could pass you unnoticed. Yeah. All right. I can finally get the damage on this guy, but I lose the move and the ally immune. Am I okay with the move and the ally immune loss? For the damage, I think I am. So this guy finally does three damage. Beetle leader. Beetle leader. You're a beetle eater. Okay. We got all alphas and leaders going on here. Uh, let's see here. Where are you going to go? Probably attack this. You're just going to hide somewhere. You're going to charge something. Wow, I feel like I'm not going to have a good way of stopping this guy's charge unless I put somebody in front of him. I'm going to have to try to throw something in front of this guy, I think. I think I may put all my guys up here so that they can't get wrapped. Or have my guy that's immune to wrap be the only one, be the, like, the juicy um, bait for wrapping. So... Put you there. Yeah, basically, I'm going to put this guy here so that it'll look, he'll really want to wrap right there because this guy will get wrapped and these two buildings, but he'll be free of it. So, and this guy's probably going to charge something else. We're going to throw somebody in front of him, hopefully. And yeah, we'll put you back here. Moving guys to the left and right is what we want to do. All right. This could be rough. This could be rough. We are very low on power grid here. That is, that was not what I was expecting, okay. Which damage can I do? Three damage there. Uh, let's see here. So if I were to throw you that way... Couldn't move you that way to kill that guy is what I'd like to do. Oh, uh, gosh. Why'd you have to walk up right up to the building? If he was here, I could just knock him that way. Uh, I feel like these freaking guys are getting smarter. Got to go soon. Class are starting. You'll be back tomorrow, assuming you're streaming. I'll uh, Actually, tomorrow is the first Tuesday of the month, so I will not be streaming. Thank you for asking that, actually. Just a reminder to you guys, tomorrow is first Tuesday of the month. I'll be in Fort Worth all day, so no stream tomorrow. 
I will be here on Wednesday, and we will be playing Slay the Spire on Wednesday, so. They need to implement Alpha Scions that have a multiple effect. Oh my god, why would you want them to do that? They already have the leader Scions that do that kind of thing. Sounds like a horrible idea. God, I can't even move there to throw him. On Thursday, yes. On Thursday, I will be playing this. So I will be here on Thursday. Much damage. Almost killed this guy. Well, let me see here. Do I absorb that damage? I can't afford to absorb that damage. Leader Scions sound evil. Uh, leader Scions is actually not that bad because his health is not that high. The worst part about the Leader Scion is all the other minions in the group that can screw up your turns, basically. All right, I think what I'm going to do is... Gosh. Damn, I need these these guys' positions are now screwing me up. So if I can move this guy here, shoot that, that will knock him that way. And then go here to block that and knock that guy sideways. Guess I could knock him sideways. Shield that. That'll make him hit that. We only take one grid damage. We can do that. Set that guy on fire and make him not hit anything. That's actually my best bet. Don't love this, but this is what we're going to do. Oh, that also reduces their health. Okay, so that's pretty good. That actually kills that guy. All right. All right, we'll go with that. Take one grid damage. Hope for uh, resist, but... It's not, not starting out amazing. Oh, you even start set fire to the ground. Great. Happy birthday to the ground. Okay. Yikes. Oh, man. Oh, man. This is not looking good. This is not looking good, man. God, there's friggin' fires everywhere, too. Uh, does the power grid apply to the whole island? Well, power grid is basically just your health. So, yes. It applies to the whole island, but it's just it's your health. This is so freaking bad right now. Um, guess I can do that. Then unlock that guy that way. It'll kill that guy. Free him. Set him on fire. How much damage do you do? You do two plus two, so four. So you would one-shot that guy. If I could move you that way and deal with this guy. Problem is I need to move that guy there. That kills you. And then we do two damage to our own guy. Okay, we're going to do this. We're going to damage our own guy here to protect our grid. We must hurt our own people. We must sacrifice for the greater good. Alright. If it depletes, you die completely. It will not regenerate unless you get power from missions or by you buying it. Yeah. Yeah. It's basically, you need... This is this is your life and you need to heal it through different ways to not die, basically. Alright, so you're on fire, which is not good, man. At least he's not doing anything. Okay, alright. You are 
Okay. Um. Do, do, do. Do, do, do. Do, do, do. I'd love to move this guy in front of that guy. I might have to give up my perfect island to try to get... Um, Try to not take grid damage. Well, let me see here. How much damage will you take? He'll push you back, and you know what? If I move this guy here, this guy will charge, hit his shield. This guy will actually do a pretty good chunk of damage to that guy. Yeah, okay, okay. Uh, and then we can go ahead and stop that guy from doing damage. And I can go uh, here and repair myself. Alright, guys. Fight smarter, not harder. So you're going to do four damage to this guy, and he'll die from the fire. Okay, so this should actually kill the boss right here. Um, and you can just shield for no reason. Alright. We'll be playing some arc, but you will keep chat open, so lurk in a bit. Alright, Desert Eagle. Enjoy your arc, my friend. Nice. Nice. Okay. We got the boss kill. Now we just need to survive one more turn without, not, without taking too much damage. Which might be difficult. Okay. So I have to hit this guy with this guy, or I can shield. If I shield, this guy will not die. So I could deal with this by just shielding that and shielding myself. I can throw this guy. I can kill this guy. Yes. So if I go here, you do two. Oh, but it's a fire, so the fire would actually kill this girl. Which is not good. If I do that, you're dead. I can just dodge out of the way and move that guy that way. And then... Throw you there, and we should be good. Alright, I think we're good. Does Silica seem a little taller? <laughs> no. You you got shorter. Alright. GG, okay. Well, we're probably going to go to the final island here and just repair as much as possible because I don't think I can survive a fourth island right now. I don't have my guys quite upgraded as much as I'd like, but I think if I try to do a fourth island, all the alphas and our Lord low damage will not be good. We did get three perfect islands, though. Three perfect islands. Alright, after attacking it. Oh! Smoke drop. Frickin' one of the best things in the game right there. Smoke frickin' drop. Alright, who do we give that to? Either L Lily Reed or Silica. Um, doesn't need to be powered. Well, let's give it to one, then we'll see what we uh, what we do with the rest of our reputation here. Okay, we're gonna sell sell you. That gives us ten, so we can get up to three reactor core. I want to heal five. If I heal five, I'd be able to get one more core. If I heal four, I'll be able to get two more core. What do I want to get with my cores? Health on you would be helpful. Um, health on the gravity mech. Yeah, with the shield, that might not be needed. Maybe I do just get health on both of these guys. I don't have a ton of damage. I don't think I care about ally immune on this. Why not chuck Beetle into the water? Was there a way to do that? I don't know if there was a way. If there was a way to do it, then 
depth than I should have. I thought I saw that there wasn't a way to do that, so. I think I am just gonna get health here. Basically, I'm just gonna heal everything. So, let's get one, two, one, two, three, four. We'll have one off a of max there, and we get health on these two guys. Or I get, could get rid of shield self to get plus one damage, but no, shield is too good. There we go. There was? Okay, well that was my bad. That might have been maybe throwing him southeast rather than up top. Maybe I didn't think I had to move forward or something, I don't know. All right, we're doing it. We're going for Final Island, man. The last stand. Let's see if we can do this thing. All right, let's hope some of these guys kills themselves. Kills damn selves. Um, okay, charge guy. Their move is not very good. Will I be able to one-shot any of these guys? No. No, I will not. So, looks like we won't get a turn one lethal on anybody unless we do two attacks on a guy. So, let's do this, I guess. Just stack them on top of each other here. Does it throw then one space? It throws from one space in front to one space behind. So, I didn't think there was a way to do that, but maybe there was. Anybody want to kill themselves? Well, that's going to cancel the attack, I believe. So, and that guy's going to fall into the lava. So that, it's two guys I don't have to actually worry about. So that's great. That is actually great. Oh, oh, and I can make that guy shoot that guy. Oh, that's good. So if I do that, you block a spawn, and you shoot that guy for three. He'll be on fire. Lava happens first, so that guy's gonna fall into the lava. That's two guys we don't have to worry about. Problem is I can't really kill this guy. But I can throw him behind me and he'll hit that guy too, so that'll be like lethal turn one on that guy. That is it's a really good start. Nope, that's not what I want to do. Or I could throw that guy into the water. Let's see, how much damage are you doing? You're doing two. So you will do four damage to that guy. He's going to be on fire for one. So he won't die unless I use this guy to kill him. All right, let's make sure. Let's have the boss die turn one. I think that's the most important thing. So we're going to do this first. Shield that and yourself. That guy there. Throw you. And that should be everybody dead except for that guy and this guy who will have one health. That is a great turn one, man. Nice. <laughs> oh man. Lava lava was huge there. Lava was huge. Bam! <laughs> what a nice turn one that was. Oh gosh, okay, this is not as nice a turn here. Um, can I kill you? Nope, that's one off. Damn. There's no way you'd be able to move far enough. Could smoke that guy, though. That's a lot of damage potentially right there. Four, one, two. Yeah, there's no way I could move far enough to deal with that guy. All right. Um, attack order here. I don't I can get anybody to kill that guy either. I think I have to smoke this guy to not take the damage, actually. Smoke him if you got him. And I can't kill this guy just by throwing him that way, so I think that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to kill you with that. OK, 
can actually use the rock to block that one there. Oh wait, I can't smoke and throw this guy. Damn it. I think I gotta do this then. Push that guy out so he doesn't, or I just absorbed his damage and do what I was gonna do. How much damage is that? Two. I do block another spawn if I do that. If I absorb this damage, we get to block another spawn. Let's do that. Let's see, where do we want to put this? Probably right here, so they don't go there to attack that stuff in the future. There we go. All right. Feel like that's a little earlier than I wanted to use the smoke bomb, but. That's a that's up, up to four grid damage we were preventing, so I'd say it's worth. I would say that is worth. Hashtag worth. Take two damage here. Oh god, it's one of the freaking bomb throwing dudes. Nice. All right, and it forced that guy into there. That's great. At least that guy's killing himself. Yeah. Wow, this guy's pretty screwed right here. Uh, I guess he can throw that guy in the lava. I can free that guy. Ooh, and he actually kills the bomb. That's great. And then one, two, three. Four. I can block that and throw that guy. Okay, that actually should kill everybody except for that guy, I believe. And possibly... Get this guy to fall in the lava? If I could move there, I could. Shoot my own guy, but no. Okay, All right, so we're just going to do this. There. Free that guy. Go there and block while almost killing that guy. There we go. And we should take no grid damage because that guy will kill that before it explodes. All right. Should be no grid damage so far. Beautiful. Nice. And we block the spawn, so we just have these last two guys. Three guys? Three guys to deal with. Plus the bomb, which will get meth group screwed up by that thing. That's great. That guy is an issue, though. Okay. Wow. I actually can't stop that. It's only one damage. Can I stop that? No, the smoke screwed me that time. Um, hmm. Well, if I knock that into the ocean of lava, can I do anything with it then? No, but if I kill that, that still does damage there. Uh, I can't arty him because the arty can't fly. If I go there, it would still do damage, so I might as well just let him do that one damage. I think my best is just to knock that into the, if the, if the, well, I don't actually need to do that because that thing dies from the lava, so. If I could shield it, I would be fine, but the smoke has actually stopped me from being able to do that. Um... Is there any way for me to even get any experience here? Yeah, I think I just have to accept that one damage. I can't think of a way to actually shoot that guy because this entire row is blocked from me moving. Does my guys... No, none of my guys have smoke protection. Uh, wait, does she... Oh, Camila, I forgot. You're right. Webbing, but not... I thought it's only web, but it hits webbing and smoke, so I can shield it. 
Immunity to smoke. I totally forgot that I had that. You are right. Good call. Good call. All right, there we go. And then I can kill this guy for a little bit of experience here. I only use that girl for her immunity to webbing. I always forget that it's also smoke. Good call, man. Burner and Gila Witch. MVPs. Because my brain is not the MVP. All right. Zero damage, phase one. Love it. Yeah, I just, I only think of that guy as having, or that girl as having webbing immunity. I never, I think that's the first time I've used the, the smoke uh, immunity on that character. I'm pretty sure that's the first time. It's crazy. Yeah, that guy's going to get squashed by the bomb. That's great. It's not great as this guy being alive. All right. Let's see what we can do, man. Let's see what we can do. Deploying Renfield Bomb. Thank you, Nancy Reagan. Splatted. You had her with Smoke Squad once. That was great. That does sound pretty awesome. I'll have to, I'll have to use her on the Smoke Squad for one of my wins I need to get. Okay. So I actually have pretty decent move right here where I can shoot that and make that guy not hit anything. Um, I could just move the Renfield Bomb out of the way and shield it. Actually, it'd be even better if I go here, because that guy will get squatted, splatted. Shield that and move it out of the way. We'll do one damage to my guy when I knock him into me, but then I can... This won't block, but it'll do three damage to that guy. And we'll take no grid damage. Do I like that? I like it. Get rid of this. Getting rid of the bomb guy is actually my first priority, I feel like. Because something, an enemy that adds more enemies is my worst enemy. <laughs> could I have done that in a different order? I don't think I could have, actually. All right. You're out. Have a nice Monday, everyone. All right, Pink Floyd. Have a great rest of your day, my friend. Thank you so much for hanging out. We'll see you next time. Splat. All right, one guy splatting is pretty good. That guy adding fires everywhere is a little scary. Back emergence point sealed. Okay, let me see here. If I move this guy over, he'll block that. And this guy will actually... Three, four, five, die. I could block this and throw this guy onto there. Can I kill this guy is the question. So I can actually... Make him block it. I need to do damage there. Can I get him to... Damn, this guy being blocked kind of sucks. Um, actually, if I do this, that would let you move maybe to here. Throw that guy there. I think I'm going to let this damage happen. Can't you boop the boss in the lava? You can, but it doesn't kill him. It will just interrupt his attack. So I'd rather use him to kill somebody than just interrupt his attack. So I'm thinking I'm going to do this. So that'll kill this guy. I'm going to throw this guy. Kills him. That lets you move here. And you'll die from that thing. So that should be zero grid damage here. Yeah, cool. I like it. Shield on the Renfield bomb immediately pays off. Nice. But yeah, the uh, the bosses like are your own mech where it's called massive and massive things. Don't die to water or lava, it just interrupts what they're doing. Alrighty then. I don't want to do this. I kinda wanna repair this guy. Um 
you, I can just outright kill you that way. Then I could, um... Shield. Uh, no, we'll just knock this guy over. And then we'll go here, repair, so you're not on fire. And you won't die from blocking or anything. This has been pretty clean so far. Let's see if we can finish it cleanly. One more turn after this, we'll have... Four Vec to deal with. But we still have taken no grid damage. Clean boss fight so far. Let's see if we can finish him. Finish him. It's four guys. Two charging guys. Any of you charging guys want to kill yourselves? No? Okay. It's too much to ask for. Alrighty. Um... What do we got here? What do we got? Just knock you that way, and that protects all that. Could get you to f die there. And let's see. Attack order. Could throw you in there. We take this one damage. How much damage do you do? You do two. Either of these guys hitting this is a chance of killing it. Pretty neat trick you learn is that if you repair while standing on a tile which is on fire and actually puts the fire out. Yes, discreet RV. I, uh, that's something that I forget about, but you're right. That is a mechanic that works. You're absolutely right. So I can do that. All right, I believe that's GG. We take uh, two grid damage here. But not taking, or we have a small chance of resisting it. GG, boys. Think we got there. Think we got there. Oh, he died from the fire before that could even happen. Get my cookie ready. Gotta get my cookie ready. Oh, we even resisted it. Nice. GG, cookie time. Hard mode on Steel Judoka. I feel like I'm getting better at the Steel Judoka. GG Cookie Time. By the way, if there's anybody new to the channel, please do hit the follow. Thank you for all the new folks who have been joining us today. Hope you guys are having a good time. I'm having a blast. Speaking of blast. Alright. Let's see what our score was. 